probably the first opportunity now that uh, Salford can camp in the Tigers' red Take danger zone. Oh. Well, they just complete through the, the middle with the forwards. Anderson gets the ball away. Here's Matty Smith. Now Daniel Holdsworth. Nice step around Ryan McGoldrick there. Joel Moon is the dummy half. Moon gets away from a couple, drives it in towards the 20 Whoa, metre line. Oh, now they've been opting for the high kick. Maybe this one on the ground might help. Smith. Oh, look, the drop of the shoulder from Smith. First try at the new ground for Salford and Matty Smith. Hamper the lines and obliterate them. This what? is Nathan Massey. One drive, will Daniel Clark go on his Woo! own? Throw the dummy, will you just slide underneath? they got plenty of numbers there. Emmett! And he's trying to inch his way to the line. Be an interesting call for the video referee if he gets to the line and you can't tell. Danny Orr, got Randy the Chase, got gets the it wide to Richard Owen, try for Castleford! Day, but not on a night when we're oh, covered in snow. Oh. Matty, quicker, you're right. Dixon gets it away to Rangi Chase. Chase trying to work some of his magic. He did the right thing as well. He knew that if he'd have offloaded, that the wing had good, had gone right over into the sideline. So Arundel uh, didn't want the possession. It's a real arm wrestle. It's not a classic, but uh, you've got to give praise to these guys. Oh, great run from the hooker. It is Daryl Clark. And the ball comes back to Richard Owen, and Owen kicks for territory down this right-hand side, and it's hacked forward by the winger, it will hit the end goal early, this is a try! It is a try for Josh Griffin! And credit, though, to Castleford's oh. defence on that one, Steve. They put him under pressure, he's kicking from a long way out. It was going to be very, very difficult for him to put a, a kick that found some ground. This is, they're turning the screw now, the Castleford Tigers, and they could come home here very, very strong. Rangi Chase just showed it to a couple, then gets the ball wide to Arundel. He gets it further wide. That's brilliant rugby league in this weather, isn't it? They're, it they're is. still trying to throw the ball around like They're still going to be great in summer. Chase again just gave it there to uh, Stuart Jones. Five metres away from the line, two tackles remaining this set of six. Castleford looking to try and put this game away if they can. Danny Orr, Rangi Chase, back it comes to Richard Owen. And Owen, does he get away from the would-be tackle of Joel Moon? No, not really, because Matty Smith was there as well. This is the last one, and McGoldrick finds Chase. Kick, kick over the top, oh, it's bounced for them. They will put this game to bed, I think. Well, we mentioned before the match that uh, if you allow this guy to build in confidence, he's going to create all sorts of problems, and this second half, he has been superb. Rangi Chase, he was all over the shop in the the first 40 minutes, but he really has come to the fore in this second half. Free movement! They haven't given uh, oh, Daniel oh. Holdsworth an oh. inch, despite the fact that Salford led 4-0. Four. Castleford have bossed it. this. Hold, hold. And not only, you've got to take into consideration, you know, Rangi Chase has been very good with ball in hand, but now his, his defence has been superb, hasn't it? He has. There's a slight... Oh, there still is, because here's Patton, fed by Moon. Ball on the inside. And here they come, Salford, with Matty Smith, who's already scored one try. He can feed it wide, which he does, and they're going to get over here for the try. Three minutes remaining. I think they've got the game now. Eight points. Can't see Salford coming back from this position, scoring twice. No, and, and not with the, the ability of uh, Danny Orr, and especially Rangi Chase with the kicking game. And he's just quite happy to just... Uh, Stay down here, though they are they're trying to keep it alive. Milner trying to get away from Pagliacina, does so, but uh, runs into another ambush. Clark's waiting, 10 metres out. There's Danny Orr, and it's Rangi Chase again. Delayed the pass, found Richard Owen. Castleford go home with the win. No doubt about it now.